To write the formula for zinc nitrate, we go to the periodic table. We look up zinc, which is Zn, and then nitrate, that's not on the periodic table. We have this ATE. That means it's a polyatomic ion. So we have to look that up on a table of common polyatomic ions, and that's NO3 minus. So zinc, that's a metal, and then this nitrate, that's a group of nonmetals. Metal and nonmetals, that's ionic. When we have ionic compounds, we need to consider the charges on the zinc here. And then we know that NO3, that nitrate, has a minus charge, a one minus charge. On the periodic table, zinc is a transition metal, but it's a bit of an exception. It's always two plus. And these charges here, they need to add up to zero since zinc nitrate, that's a neutral compound. So they don't add up to zero. We don't have a net charge of zero, but we can change the subscripts down here to make that happen. We'll use the crisscross method. We'll move the one here and the two over here. We don't write the one by convention. Let's get rid of the charges. And then we need to put parentheses around the nitrate because we have two nitrate ions. And that's the formula for zinc nitrate. Let's check our work, make sure we got it right though. We have two plus we said for the zinc and one minus for the nitrate. We have two of these nitrate ions and each one is one minus. So two times one minus, that's two minus one times the two plus, two plus. These add up to zero, give us a net charge of zero. This is the correct formula for zinc nitrate. Clean it up one last time. And that's the formula for zinc nitrate. This is Dr. B and thanks for watching.